like to begin with a prayer. This is a prayer that is so important that when I learned it as a kid, I didn't understand the depth of it until I went to the seminary at the North American College in Rome and learned the depth of this prayer. I'm still learning it. This prayer is so powerful that it literally has turned sinners into saints. This prayer stopped somebody from attacking a woman. Uh, a man was going to violate her. And this prayer um, is still now, and I'm so grateful that uh, Father was talking about it before. It's still used in exorcisms. So would you like to learn this prayer with me? Yes. Yeah. Thank God. I'm going to have to learn this prayer. All right. So please uh, pray with me this incredibly powerful prayer. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. That's the prayer. And you're all thinking, can homilies be as short as that, Father? <laughs> it, it really is the most powerful prayer we have because it tells us that everything we do is not going to be done in my name. Besides, you can barely even pronounce my last name. And you did a very good job, but I'm going to help everyone with it. It's a, you're, you're using the, you know, the Hispanic American accent. So let me give it to you again. It's spelled P-A-T-A-L-I-N-G-H-U-G-W-X-Y-N-Z. Okay? And, uh, very simple. In the Filipino traditional accent, it is pronounced Smith. 